this is libgen dot is so this is a controversial controversial website because it was copyrighted material you can find various books and all here so i don't know whether i will i should be talking about this website in this video so moving on to the next website so this is the website here here you can see the various atlas of hip and this various cases so we will first select this one any of this you can select if you want to see the atlas of the ankle atlas of the hip atlas of the elbow so the anatomy basic anatomy will be there here i will click on hip plus of hip and this side is open i will full screen it here it is loading it takes a bit of time because the site is large all the images mri images are there here you can see nice presentation of all the things marked here you can see i'm scrolling i'm going interior and posterior and you can see the beautiful anatomy shown here so this is the <coughs> sagittal view i will go to the coronal view and this is the axial view loading on the left hand side you can change the view so this is the axial view you can see all the things are marked nicely here so you can learn MRI, MRI very easily from this website. So I will close this. Then there, these are the cases. You can also see the various lesions cases. Here I will select this one. Now here the various cases are there. You can select anyone <laughs> like this one. 22 year old with knee injury. So here, this uh, this is the coronal section. This is the sagittal section, and uh, this is the history on the right hand side. Twenty year old football player with acute onset lateral right knee pain during a game. So here is the case discussion here. Here they will show that there is a focal cartilage law loss, and there is located in the middle third of the condyle and measures around seven mm. So whenever you click this this site will come here so so beautifully they will show the site they are referring to okay so now on scrolling the above images on both the t1 and t2 images you can see this nice anatomy here and the lesion so you can double click it and it will open it in a new page in a full page like this and you can scroll it up and down and see you can see this pcl and you can see the normal acl fibers and all that so this is a very good website i, I learn all my mri and all the cases from this website so now the third website uh, is arthroschool.com yeah this is the arthroschool i will again enter it arthroschool arthroschool.com so this is the website here actually this is a paid website but some of the things are uh, free which we need so here this is the open shell so you have to make an account here free account i have made one account so you can see my name here so this is the open shelf here you can see the various videos here so this is especially useful for the sports medicine or sports injury guys here you can see the various videos they have and they have nice discussion on all these topics posterior ankle arthroscopy total knee arthroplasty atlas tendon problems physical examination of this shoulder joint okay stemless arthroplasty tk unstable knee robotic stator tha 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 uh, here is the anterior closing wedge osteotomy for slope correction so you can see nice videos here which you will not find anywhere else and the last is SciSpace. SciSpace. So SciSpace is the AI search tool. Here you will find the various articles. All the things you want to know, all the your queries you can know from this site. Like let's uh, let's put here femoral tunnel. Femoral tunnel. Sorry, femoral. 
tunnel in Excel. So it will first uh, show you that try searching for these three things like what is the prevalence of femoral tunnel kinesis in terrain ACN surgery? How does the femoral tunnel location and size impact the outcome of ACL procedures? So you can either select these these questions or you can just type femoral tunnel in ACL and click it. Here it will come up with the answer from the top five papers. You can see the tunnel position techniques, anatomical and isometric method. It should be close to the lateral intricate nylon edge to ensure proper anatomy and isometry. And here it will also mention the paper in which it is mentioned. So here you can read more and all the papers are mentioned from where they have taken this references. Okay. So here these on the left hand side lower down these there will be 10 papers here. And on the right side the gist of the paper will be mentioned here. So you can just uh, see that paper and view that gist and then you can also click on load more papers here you'll be able to see these papers now there are 20 papers then again load more papers then 10 more papers will come and load more papers then 10 more papers will come so so forth you can click on load more paper and get the various papers and then you can go on high quality this is the standard function and if you click on high quality then the further search will be done deep research here you can see they have done further research and provided with the answer and these are not just AI AI is working on various papers and then giving you answers so it is more authentic okay so here the papers are mentioned here the gist is a bit more clarifying or good better than before and then you go on deep review so i haven't checked this deep review till now go on the deep review so let's check the pricing here so here deep pricing basic premium advanced pricing so i have never used uh, this premium function till now so standard and high quality has worked till now so even let's research the deep one here okay so narrow down he wants to narrow down down my research because it is a deep review so we can search on surgical techniques surgical techniques so it is finding the relevant papers here 10% is done so these are the four website uh, you can know you can master and these will be very helpful for your academic and even your surgical career so I hope you like the video so if you like the content kindly like subscribe and share and see you in next video thank you